let's try to find device files for our mouse. It should probably be under the input directory. Let's head over to that directory. Okay. And um, let's list what's inside. All right, so we can see we have a mouse zero, mouse one, and mouse two. And this represent individual mouse devices. Let's go to by path directory. Okay, CD by path um, and see what's inside. Okay, okay, we can see that there is a lot of turquoise color here. And we already know that turquoise is for symlinks. The symlinks point to different device files, right? Um, for example, if a mouse link points to an input device file for a mouse connected via USB. The symlinks provide a consistent way to refer to input devices based on their physical connection. The kernel and associated devices files manage the functionality and interaction with these devices. So the source code for the input device drivers isn't directly visible in the root directory. Source files can be downloaded separately from kernel repositories 